If you sprinkle some salt on some tomato slices and eat them, they'll be really delicious because there is sodium and the tomato pulp has glutamates. But I'm not interested in promoting MSG. I want to try and declutter our minds about food. When you Google for any ingredient, you will only get bad news because news is the organized collection and dissemination of extremely rare events. The boring normality of most food is not viral news. Stop being needlessly afraid of food. When something is being touted as being dangerous, it's important to understand how much of it you actually eat. You should be way more worried about the amount of salt and sugar in your packaged food than the extremely tiny amount of MSG. Find out if you're already consuming it without even knowing it. That should make you seriously doubt the scaremongering. Even in places where MSG is considered, okay, only 8% of it comes from additives. Where does 92% come from? The food you eat. That is because the G in MSG is an amino acid. Literally all protein you eat is likely to have some glutamate. Human breast milk has a large amount of glutamates because toddlers love umami. In conclusion, oh my God, this is poison can safely be ignored. In moderation, most things are safe. In excess, everything is bad for you. Food should be a matter of discovery and delight, not pseudoscientific scaremongering.